CDC6 has 48 user configurable buses, all of which can be either auxiliary sends, subgroups, or matrix outputs. So I can configure the bus structure of the console to suit whatever my application. To change the bus configuration is very simple and also snapshot specific. A double tap on the labeling strip opens up the bus settings page and I then can go in and choose to change the bus configuration very easily. Having changed the bus structure, I then go to my bus overview screen and scroll through the outputs to view the various bus configurations. Once I've configured the buses the way I want them, I can then label the buses to enable very easy navigation. Once I've selected the bus, I select the rename option, which then allows me to rename the bus depending upon what it is I'm using that for.